Hey guys, what's going on? I've Animal here, back with your latest update for the Call of Duty website. Right, now I've got a lot of stuff to go through in this video, much like the last one, so I'm going to go through it quickly. Right, here on your screen you've got the new update. It says, um, the enemy could be anyone and they could be anywhere. Now, there's one thing that struck me about that, and that is Reznov. Now, you might be thinking, what the fuck, Reznov died in the last, uh, Black Ops. So, we all, uh, we all pretty much know it's going to be Black Ops 2 now. So, um, we don't really know what the storyline is, but here's what I'm guessing. I'm guessing Reznov is going to be the enemy based off of that statement, because in Black Ops, um, you actually know, at the beginning of each mission, you've got a little bit of intel at the bottom left, right? And you've got a designate number, and like a uh, military photonic alphabet um, word, so like X-Ray, um, Charlie, Delta, you know what I mean. So, on the first mission, uh, the word you've got is X-Ray, second, Romeo, third, Echelon, or Echo, yeah, I think it's Echo. Um, you know, so on and so forth. So, if you take the first letter from each word in every mission, you end up with X, X, R, E, Z, N, O, V, D, X, I, S, D, X, E, A, D. Now, if you remove the X's, you end up with Reznov is dead. Now, that is uh, pretty awesome. So, um, but then, if you take the designate number, and um, you convert it to a letter using alphanumeric conversion, you, so, you know, A equals... 1, B equals 2, etc. Um, you end up with, or is he dead? There was who, nobody is who he says he is. Now, that kind of is a bit weird. Like, it doesn't really make a lot of sense. But removing a few of the words, you end up, is he dead? Is he who he says he is? So, um, to me, that kind of struck me quite a lot. I was like, whoa, that's pretty awesome. So, um, I'm guessing Reznov is going to return in the next Black Ops. This is just a guess, it's a theory, I'm not saying it is going to happen, I'm not saying, yeah, this is what's going to happen, yeah. This is my theory, okay? Um, I'm probably wrong, but it's worth putting it out there. I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's one part of it. Now I'm going to move on to the second part of the video, where I'm actually going to talk about the phrase itself. Now, obviously, the phrase pops up in, like, sort of blocks. So, um... In total, the phrase is, the enemy could be anywhere, and it could be anyone. So, um, as you see, the is the first, uh, sorry, I kind of hiccuped. Um, the is the first word to pop up. And if you actually see, the E on the, just before it turns into an E, is an actual faded out W. And then, enemy could, the L is actually a Z, or Z, however you want to pronounce it, before it pops up. And then B, the E, actually before it turns into an E, is a Q, right? And then um, anywhere, or any, yeah, anywhere is actually, the first E is an O, right? So, that, and then, the finally, um, the last could, is actually, the D is actually an H before it pops up. So that leaves us with a bunch of random letters. And we're sort of like, well, what do we do with these random letters? So the letters are W, Z, Q, O, H. So, you know, what do we do? Now, this is what I've done. Now, I don't quite know what to do from here. So, I've taken the W, Z, Q, O, H, and I've turned them, using alphanumeric conversion, I've turned them into numbers. And I have got the numbers 22, I think 22, I don't know, I think I've lost that number. There we go. I've got 22, 25, 14, and 8. Um, if I'm correct. Now, that's just one part of the number. So, now, if you go back to, if you look at the, um, at the phrase, you actually see in the bottom left-hand corner, there are numbers. There's a timer, right? And it looks like it starts at four, doesn't it? Well, you would actually be wrong. It does not start at four. It starts at 3.23, and it goes up to 4.13. Um, and that's only when you first open it. Um, when after that, the the will will just stay there. It will it will always be an e. There'll be no w behind it, and the the it won't start from three point two three anymore. It starts from about four or something. So from there, you get the numbers three point two three, four point oh six, four point ten, and four point thirteen, all the way up until the end of the sentence. Now I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with these. You know, I could turn them into numbers, but I haven't tried that yet, and I'm pretty sure it wouldn't really give me a lot of information. So I don't know what to do. I'm stuck. I'm sitting here and I'm thinking, what the fuck? You know, I've added them together, divided them, whatever. It doesn't really give me a lot. It just ends me out with another number. And I'm just a bit like, well, you know, this is kind of useless, you know? Um, 
What do I do with it? So, I'm going to leave this bit up to you guys. You've got you've got the numbers there on the screen. Go see what you can do with them. I don't know. It's kind of nah. It's not much really you can do with it. But anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed my analysis of the latest Call of Duty leak. Be sure to tune in tonight as um it's Friday and I won't have to go to bed. I can actually stay up and find the new one because I'm in the UK and I've got a lot of school work to do and stuff so kind of staying up to like 12 o'clock just to find the latest thing and make a video out of it. So anyway, um, hope you enjoyed the video, hope you enjoyed my analysis of it. Make sure you leave a like and a comment or whatever, subscribe for more analysis and uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video and peace. Oh, yeah, yeah.